Robertson, the Technology Coordinator at Ilsley Public Library. This tutorial will show you how to transfer VHS footage to the computer in what's known as capturing. We use the Elgato TV video capture device and we'll show you how to use it along with the software you'll need on the computer. First, make sure everything is attached. The red, yellow, and white RCA cable goes back to the VCR and the single white cable is a USB cable that goes in the back of the computer. The small remote control will turn on the TV, and the larger one will turn on the VCR and DVD deck. Notice the selection switch to switch between VCR and DVD. We want to make sure we're on VCR. Insert your tape. Hit play. Turn down the volume so you don't bother others in the library. The volume will stay high going into the computer. Now we'll turn to the computer. First, go all the way to the top of your screen to the Go menu. Down to Applications. We're looking for Elgato Video Capture. The icons are arranged alphabetically. So go to E, double click, and you can agree to the licensing agreement. We've already licensed this, so click on Next and Agree and skip registration. You can click OK here, and then call your movie whatever you'd like. I'll call it Video Capture Test. The time is approximate. It just gives you an estimate of how large the resulting file will be. So you can see the size in megabytes. Click on continue. If you already hit play on the VCR, you should see your video. But if not, hit play and now you can see it. Click on continue. The green lights indicate that sound is coming into the computer. You should hear it through the headphones if you've got them on. Click on start recording. And you'll see that this timer will start to change, showing that you are copying the VHS to the computer. Now notice the red record button hasn't changed at all, but does say stop recording underneath it. When you're ready to stop, press the button. And now you can trim the beginning and end if there's any unwanted pieces of your video. So simply slide the slider the beginning to where you'd like to begin. Do the same at the end. Click on continue. And here you can see where your video is located in the guest user account, in the movies folder, and video capture test. If you want to tape another, click again. Or if it's your last one, you can quit. You can close that window and I'll show you how to find the video that you just created. Go back to the Go menu, to Home, and then there's a folder called Movies. Double click to open it. There you can see your video capture test file. You can take that with you or we can do something like add it to iMovie to edit it. I'm going to take this one with me. So I'll put my thumb drive in. You notice it pop up on the screen, and I simply drag and drop to copy the video file to my thumb drive. It's a very small file here, so it goes quickly. If it's a longer one, it may take a few minutes. Don't forget to drag your thumb drive to the trash to safely eject it. You're done, and you've got your video. You can log out or shut down the computer.